Good day, everybody. Zat here. Strig Toaster here. We're back in the Urban Design Lodge with our uh, cities. Well, your city, your old city. Strict well, now, now it's yours. And it's actually ours, if you think about it. Oh, I should play Cause... the game here. Yeah, it's our city. It's You're... our little baby. <laughs> oh, yeah, don't don't say that. <laughs> um, so I'm, I'm looking at all the changes that you did. Uh, I'm, I'm really glad that you kept my original layout, but you made an amazing job. Uh, Know, converting it from a dump into a place uh, worthy of living. Yeah, well, I kept the coast down here because you had some decent roads going on. I actually didn't touch anything at all. Um, I just left the grid on the side because I think that's basically all that's going to fit there. Hmm. And I rebuilt the uh, top because that was some industry back here in miscellaneous buildings. Um, there's not a lot of room on the top to do anything fancy. I've actually removed some of what I had. But it looks okay. It looks it looks beautiful. Uh, I mean, the trees help a lot, and I'm not sure if your Sims are happy with the pollution. <laughs> Apparently, yeah, not. there's still a bunch of pollution under the bridge. Here. But whatever, <laughs> on the surface, it looks it looks it looks uh, beautiful. So yeah, I have to apologize to my viewers. They're probably yelling at the screens that I built a, a trade port instead of a trade depot. And that's why I couldn't expand. What did you do that? Um, well, you had a trade depot somewhere in the hills. Yes. And then I had accidentally built a trade port by the uh, city entrance. Uh -huh. um, and then, yeah, I couldn't figure it out. And I re so, well, I thought I was rebuilding a depot and it thought it fixed it, but apparently I was just fixing the problem inadvertently. Okay, it's almost full, so you might want to take care of that. I mean, uh, I don't know. Are you going to be uh, repositioning your ore mine? Uh, your ore mine? Yeah, <laughs> your ore mine? <laughs> uh, why is it full? Uh, no, it's not. It's not full. It's almost full. Um, but I mean, if you're gonna keep mining for that, uh, I thought you said you're gonna do a, a tourist city, right? So you're probably not gonna care about that. Well, I left point. the mining there just to expand on it. I was gonna put some attractions down. I think I'm actually kind of done this city at this point. I should go back to my own. Okay. That I was gonna good. see if someone else wanted to um, take the reins and run with it, but haven't had any takers yet. Okay. I think Uto, Uto should have a hand at it. See if you can fix the traffic problems. Uh, I don't see a lot of traffic problems. I mean, it's not rush hour right now. It's 11, 20, 40, 11, 40 a.m. for me, and I don't see a ton of traffic. Yeah, but... I cleared it up a bit just by upgrading the roads, but anyways, I'm going back to my city. All right. Yeah, me too. So what's uh, what's next for you in your city? Um, I don't know. I haven't looked at it for a little while. I have most of the road network set up, and it's all kind of low density, so I guess it's just time to start um, educating and upgrading. Turn it into a city, basically, instead of a small town. Upgrading mines. Mine? Oh, mines. Mines. Yeah. Mines. Yeah, educating, upgrading mines. It was a stupid joke. Forget about it. <laughs> People of the earth, forget about it. Um, yeah, I need to probably start designing my city a bit because now it's a grid. It's a grid with an attitude, so <laughs> I need to, you know, make that attitude more Does prominent. Mean it's a grid with a bunch of crime. <laughs> yes, the grid itself is very uh, violent. I have a lot of problems in this city. I have no water. I have overflowing garbage. Oh, that's that's a nice problem. Um, right, because I just have a single water. Oh, yeah. I sent a bunch of money from uh, Strict Coast over here, and then Yuto also sent a bunch of money over from his city. So I've got about 300k to Wait. mess around. Wait, how, how, how did Yuto send you money? He's not in the same cluster, is he? Well, we're on the river. Oh, the river have, matters? We both have um, ferry terminals, so I guess that allows... Because I see him in my um, little list here, and he was there since the beginning. So I guess maybe if you do have ferry terminals, you can actually send uh, money to each other. Let me actually check here. Interesting. It doesn't show. I thought what it money was only road road connections that matter. That's what I thought too. But nope. Have to experiment with that. Maybe he just dumped the money into the river, and it just kind of disappeared. Because <laughs> I don't remember how much I sent to myself either. 
I might still be getting it later. Um, right, water. Yeah, I'm gonna upgrade the density of my industry because apparently I'm I have uh, not enough freight producers. So since I don't want to zone more industry, I just want to get more out of the same area. Mine more of Spain gas. You ever you play StarCraft? Uh, nope. Oh, you wouldn't get that then. Uh, yeah, I did not. <laughs> but I'm I sure it was. Is, I'm sure it was hilarious. <laughs> I'm sure it was very funny. Sad. I'm glad you have trust in my humor. Okay, let's oh, beat this game up. No more turtles at. You gotta remind me about every five, ten minutes to make sure that I'm not running on turtle speed. Will do. Trust me. <laughs> every time, every time I, just... I I watch Fear Spawn, I'm like, dude, go on, just put it on <laughs> on cheetah speed. But you can hear me most of the time. I'm gonna plop some trees because this looks not very fun. I know the trees will die because there's not enough water, but it will look nice in the meantime. After all, this is the design lodge, so some design needs to be applied. Just some. Yeah. Not too much. I want to try to make it random so it doesn't look fake. <laughs> but it totally looks fake. <laughs> Wait, what are you doing? Uh, just plopping trees. But I, 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 don't, I, I want it to be a little bit more random. I don't want like perfect like grid, you know, trees like in perfect areas and like just fill the entire map with trees because that doesn't look very realistic. Right. Just plop trees here and there, so it looks more you know spontaneous. If that's even a thing. Nope. That does not work. Oh well. It'll do its job. Oh, my dump's full, that's why. Oh, jeez. I really hate how um, the dump is set up, that they have an intersection that you can't draw off of. Uh, the dump? Yeah. What do you mean? Uh, you can only use the service road, I think. That's what I mean, like, the service road ends right where the dump ends, so you can't draw directly off of it because it's like right it's it's blocking itself hmm. i don't really know how to explain it i think you i know what you later. mean i will i think i know <laughs> what you mean though what the barely can draw a curved road there we go so let's see. i think i'm gonna bulldoze just the middle of my city just do plop an avenue there that will make things Better, hopefully. I want to get rid of this too. Goodbye, Sims. Goodbye, Sims. Goodbye, <laughs> goodbye, everybody. <laughs> Oops. Simulator. Oh, that was so funny. <laughs> that was so funny. Uh, puns. Oh, I almost got hit by a blimp. That was so funny that I'm I'm still laughing. You're still laughing. Yeah. You had to mute your mic just because of the uh, belly laughs. Yeah. I might have to stop recording and just go to the bathroom and keep laughing. <laughs> we should have a competition to see how dry we can make our wit. <laughs> <laughs> that that's probably going to be a lot of fun. <laughs> I think you won just right there. <laughs> exactly. <laughs> yes. <laughs> Sarcasm. Sad chasm. Butter. Sad chasm? Yes. That's what I'm naming my next city. You should. It's an awesome name. Uh, okay. What do I need to fix my RCI? Not enough high wealth shoppers. Well, then why do I have high wealth? See, this is not how supply and demand works. If you do not have enough customers, you do not ask the mayor for more customers. You say... <laughs> This was a bad business. I'm going to shut down and sell something better. People um, in real life do complain about those things. 
and yes. playing the government. So, wow. It's, it's a realistic cool. game. Yeah. I find it funny when some of the players complain that, well, the game doesn't make sense because people just take the shortest path instead of going down proper <laughs> avenues and things. It's like, well, you know, that is exactly what happens, happens quite a bit. Yeah. <laughs> Everyone thinks the highway is going to be packed full, so they take alternate routes, and then there's no one on the highway. What am I doing? I was going to look at, um, let's see my high wealth, Not my high wealth, my uh, land value. Are you still playing on Cheetah? Yes, yes I am. I good. haven't touched it. Good, good. Actually, I need to probably play on Llama when it comes to daylight, because I can't see anything during the nighttime. It's because of your silly, uh... Filter? Filter. Whatever. <laughs> I like my filters. Why do people hate that? I mean, most people like it. I get I get mixed comments, but most are more of the comments uh, from people liking it than otherwise. So I need some more high wealth residents. Let's do that back here. Whoops. What just exploded? Time for parks. That's that's a fun part, adding parks. I used to love building parks in uh, SimCity 4, but I feel like, I mean, I know I just complained about this before, but I feel like there should be more options. I would like I would like it better if the parks kind of blended with the, you know, earth underneath them, because they have, uh, especially the ones under. Uh, medium wealth, they have this green kind of fake grass that it's very yeah. boxy. So if nice. you if you want to put a park in a roundabout, that doesn't look very nice. It looks like that fake uh, turf, like it's rubber almost. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I mean, with the parks, that they have a great system where you can expand on them, but it bugs me that nothing lines up. If they actually made it so you could like draw a single path and put some trees on the sides and put like swings over here and uh, a sandbox over there and have it all actually look like one park, that'd be great. It would be awesome if you can zone parks. I know some like city building games you can do that. Uh, Cities XL. Oh yeah, that one. I haven't played it, just saw screenshots. Have you played it? I have, not much. How fun is it? Not really, not that much. Um... I have to play it again, but I remember when I played it, it felt really dead. I think we talked about this before. Really dead? I don't yeah, remember this like conversation. I was detached from the city. Like, I can actually see, like, the Sims running around and the cars and people going to work. In uh, Cities XL, all the cars were weren't really rendered very well, hmm. and everything felt just kind of too perfect. I don't really know how to explain it. Whoops. No, I, I get it. I think like. You didn't see movement inside of them. They were just like, something like that? Is that what you're trying to yeah. say? Yeah. And the buildings didn't seem to uh, evolve too much. I don't know. I'd have to play it again to give it a proper review. I could be just talking out of my butt here. Maybe that's a uh, new what set. Yeah. That's, it's definitely in the queue. Oh, okay. I have, a lot of, I have a lot of games I want to hit. I need to get that series going up again. Should be one out soon. went abandoned. It's one of the cooler buildings. Oh no. I need to bulldoze my church. It's in the middle of progress. <laughs> Just do it slowly so no one will notice. In the middle of the night. Uh, they will notice, I think. Oh man. I put, I put my church right next to my coal mine. So it seems really happy and sick. And they can ask uh, their god for health instead of the mayor <laughs> speaking of churches let's put some of those down have you really tested how much happiness do they bring to the equation um i forget where they are so silly with oh yeah they're their worship uh i don't really know i have noticed that they do help you know make the buildings grow faster so they do work hmm. and well, the first time i built them i watched them for a bit and saw that there was actually quite a few people going to them okay so that's a good sign pretty sure they work 
and um, Maxis was smart and changed their, uh, not changed them, but set their service times to be kind of staggered. So if you have a bunch of churches in the same area, you don't get a ton of traffic all at once. Unlike the schools, where everyone goes to class at almost the same time. Oh, interesting. Didn't know that. I only blob yep. the, the same house of worship all the time. Which one? The the one that looks like a European thing. It just says church. It's the first one, oh, the yeah. gray yeah. brick. Classic church. Classic. Yeah, exactly. That's why I like it. Yeah. Well, that's mostly what we see in North America here. Well, actually, in where I live, there's quite a few mosques around here. Really? But they're usually kind of hidden behind big walls and near highways. So I don't see them too often. Okay, so how do I connect my industry now? I'm build a modern temple too. Build it in my... Oh, I already have a church. I didn't realize. I think I'm going to try to do oh. one of those. <laughs> I got lost in my own city. <laughs> I wanna when try... did I build that church? It was the one I just built. I sometimes get lost when I do cities at an angle, at a 40 degree angle, and I don't know if I'm like at the edge of the city or, or I have plenty of room to play around, mm -hmm. which is interesting because, you know, makes it not very boxy when, once you're done. But I, I'm thinking of doing in one of the corners uh, neighborhood kind of like the ones you do that have uh, like kind of a inner street with trees and it's sort of separated from the rest of the city. Oh, yeah. Yeah, I think I'm gonna try one of those. A sad theme neighborhood. Wow, I have a lot of bus riders. I'm surprised traffic hasn't crippled the city yet. <laughs> I, usually, I, should... I usually do fine by default with traffic. I've never had I mean, not never, but I lately I haven't, I've been haven't been having problems. No, we tend not to build particularly large cities. Yeah, that's true. What's your what's your population right now? Um, thirty one k. Okay, I'm thirty four, so we're almost there. I need to bulldoze my school now. God damn it! It's not gonna work, is it? Oh, 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 oh! Is that gonna work? Wait, I don't even need to. It's automatic. There we go. <laughs> so used to using the bridge tools to hitting M&M that when I was trying to build a bridge over water, I was messing around with it. <laughs> and I really should just let it do its own thing. I should ease traffic a bit. Okay, let's see. How do I make this awesome? Hmm. Hmm. I'm gonna hide my my or my coal mine just put it surrounded with trees so it seems one notice. <laughs> nice. Guess I don't need this thing anymore. Blow up the water tower. I kind of need a central park. I think that will be good. Really want that intersection there. Let's go back here. Now you're building your central park. I, uh, if I am, or you are. No, how are you? Uh, I don't know. I, I think I'm gonna break one of these uh, grids in the middle of the city that I have and just make it several parks. Just pop them here and there. I don't know. Um. Actually, I'm thinking of doing community college to increase my tech level and reduce pollution a bit. So maybe you can put a park all around community college. Yeah, let's do that. That'll be a good idea. I'm going to build some industry upwind, but I'm going to start educating right away. Okay, now that I have community college, I can get rid of my school. That will make things better, I guess. I should probably build this somewhere. Let's put it here. We can I put it over here? No!
Uh, yeah, this park kind of sucks. <laughs> but he will have to do. Hmm. Now I can plop trees all around it, and it will be awesome. Or maybe not. Well, I think we're done for now. Oh no, I want to keep I want to keep going. That's so many <laughs> cool ideas. You're at a time strict. Okay. In our next episode, we'll see us building some more. So uh, don't forget to subscribe, and we'll see you all next time. Take care, guys. <laughs>